uh, back from the lathe over there. I just chucked these up in the lathe there. Took a piece of that there brown scotch pad and just kind of, you know, buffed them off a little bit right there after that heating job. Actually, I did take the lathe file there and hit that head right there just a little bit there. Kind of, you know, so there wouldn't be no burr on yonder. The next step, and to just to show you that there was no damage to the stem, it's still, it's a very nice, let's check them, slide and fit in the stem, very nice. Let's cut them to length. We're going to need another blueprint. We just as well as get on with it. And what we've got here, looking at the side of that valve, is something like this right here. That's kind of what we got with this little protrusion up on this end. The valve going through there like that. The, the, the next procedure that we need to do is to know how long to cut these valves. To get that figure, let's do this. I'm, I'm assuming that this is a factory valve. It don't have a part number on it. This one does. It's a part number HA5491. Made in the USA, Toledo. It's got the IHC logo right yonder. Now these two valves right here, this one, this one don't have no logo on it, but it's I. Well, it's not identical either. The, the, the it does have a hole in the end. Both of them are are identical as thread length and uh, and the position of the uh, cotter hole. This one was in a head that I took off. It's a different valve. It looks like it's been cut down, and it don't have a hole for the cotter. So I'm going to discard this valve and assume that these two valves here are factory original. With that said, uh, zero out the um, caliper and let's, to get a measurement, let's measure from, uh, because all of these right here are the, 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 basically they're the same. So I'm going to take a measurement from where that flat is right there, where the 45 degree starts, I'm going to let that be the uh, the starting point to the length. So if you put it right there and come all the way down to the end, from there down to here, it's five, five. Five, sixty-two, and uh, let's lock that in. I believe that's where it's going to be right there. Let's lock that in. Five inches, five hundred and sixty-two thousandths, which that figures out nine sixteenths, five and nine sixteenths long. Now let's check it on the bath. Put it down here at the end like that and come up yonder at that one. And we do have exact measurement from the end of the valve to where that 45 starts. So let's compare it to the other known original valve. Put it to the end. Come over yonder. And it's, uh, you know, I can see a shadow there, but it's, it's uh, I'm going to call it the same. So, I'm going to lock that in. 5 inches, 562 thousandths. So, that in real numbers is, uh, the, and, and that's, that's, the, that's the measurement from here to here. Not, not the top, but where that 45 starts. That measurement right there is 5 
in uh, nine sixteenths, let's say. Yeah. Okay. Now the thread length. The thread length. We you got to know this. You got to know this stuff. Uh, thread length from the end up to the where it is starts is uh, let's get them on both of them is that much right there. That's one inch and eleven thousandths. Let's see what one inch looks like. Back that down to one inch even, and look at this right here. And you know that's what I'm going to call that. Uh, one inch long threads. So we have some numbers to work with. The thread length right here is one inch. Okay, you know that's all we need. The the size is a five sixteenths. Uh, that thread size yonder. Let's uh, let's verify it. Let's verify that thread size. And what I got right there is a five sixteenths twenty four. It's a hex die and a hex holder, and if you put that right on through there, yeah, that's what I did. I know what it was, but no, no need to guess at it. It's a uh, the thread will be a five sixteenths twenty four thread. Let's put it on there. A uh, five sixteenths twenty four. That's fine thread in common language. The uh, we got to put a hole in it, young. Might as well get that hole measured. The hole is from the end of the valve. Oh yeah, let's see what that's going to be. That's 140 thousandths. That's a little more. Even a little more than that. You know. Let's just go 150 thousandths. Yeah. That looks good. The hole will be right here, the hole from the end, from the end to there, will be 150 thousandths. We got something to work with now. Let's get that done. 